And here today for our fragrance review, we have Parfums de Marley Layton. This is my one of my Parfums de Marley collection, and I'm thoroughly glad to have it. Oh man. This one here, again, Parfums de Marley, gorgeous bottle, heavy, ceramic. It looks a lot like my Percival bottle, which is just a slightly lighter blue. I kind of wish they still had the little white text on it that they have, like late and exclusive, but minor quibble on the presentation. The cap weighs a metric ton, uh, and the bottle itself, the ceramic, just sounds absolutely wonderful. This one here is actually my scent of my day, so I'm going to spray it. Mm, very, very nice. Yeah, I missed. Oh, there we go. So this one here needs to calm down for about a minute or two on the skin. When it opens up, it's very, very strong. The pepper and some of the apple notes come through, the lavender. It really, really nice. And it's just long lasting. It has guyac wood, uh, the wood they use for, help for making oud. They have sandalwood, the cardamom, vanilla. This one here, if you ever had Boss Bottled, which has the apple note and kind of smells like apple pie with spices, this one is like that, a little bit less sweet, but it's just rich and thick. The only time I wouldn't wear this is during maybe the heat of the summer. But other than that, it is absolutely gorgeous cut through masks right now which is a great thing during the uh, pandemic that we're currently going through three or four sprays of this you're you're projecting and it lasts for a very long time especially on on shirts and such i don't know how else to say this this one here is absolutely worth the money yes it's expensive 200 some odd dollars even on discounters worth every penny Last long, projects far, gets compliments, beautiful, sexy, wonderful, smooth, a little bit spicy. It checks all the notes. The only thing it doesn't do for me personally, it doesn't have that same cleanliness vibe that I love in my Pradas and stuff like that. But that's a personal thing. This one here, for a lot of the people out there, would find this not that clean, respectable, but that masculine woody spicy slightly sweet peppery with that apple the top just gorgeous beautiful scent this one has earned many a compliment and when i was at work i shared this with uh, a woman there sprayed it onto a paper and she said i really want to bring this back for my husband gave her a decant and the husband loved it so much she loved it on him and then well they bought a bottle themselves this here is a gorgeous scent this is probably one of, if not one of my favorite parfum. It is this and Percival, the two that I have, absolutely gorgeous. Wouldn't trade them for the world. Parfums and Marley is very quickly becoming my favorite niche house. So here it is, Parfums de Marley Layton. I'm going to give it a solid nine and a half out of ten.